so i'm back with an other video so today we are going to take a look at the lineage os 18.1 rom for our j7 2015 which is based on android 11 yeah it is based on android 11 not the fake android 11 so let me show you let's jump on to the about phone now let's get into the android version 11 now tap this three to four times now you can see this is real android 11 so i really thank to the developer dario trombello and the other people who struggle a lot to port this rom for jsm 2015 and yeah let me tell you this rom is a, just a testing build for now and it's still under development so you can experience bugs but i didn't face any of them but i faced a bug which the google drive is not working and i don't think so it's bug of the lineage os rom but it's the bug of the bit gaps so I'll show you the lineage OS version 2. So it's not a lineage OS based room, but it's a lineage OS room. So yeah, you can see this. Now you can see this lineage OS version 18.1, an official build. This is an unofficial build and it comes with the Android security update December 5th, 2020, which is the latest security patch. And yeah, the vendor security patch level is of April 1st, 2018 and here's the build date of the rom you can see it's made on wednesday december 16th at seven o'clock yeah it's made at seven o'clock so this rom is ported recently but yeah it's still under development so you can experience different bugs not the same ones so what are different bugs means you will not face the same bug which uh, everyone faces but you can experience the different bugs in this rom so the rom is quite stable for me but only bug I found is with the wallpaper. So when I jump into the styles and wallpaper, so here I press on the my photos. Now just I'll select a photo or something. I want to keep it as wallpaper. So yeah, when I see, when I do this, it's doing fine. Actually, it was a bug, but I don't know when I reflash the ROM, it got fixed. So if you're facing any of these bugs, just try reflashing ROM, it will fix all your bugs. Yeah, it's stable for me right now and dark mode is also supported for this room. There is no problem in the dark mode. All are working perfectly and there is a separate dark mode even except the battery saver. So screen recording is also working perfectly. Once I'll try again cause I flashed this room again. So yeah, I think it works perfectly. So let's test. So it's recording. You can see it does record. So it again stopped screen recording why i don't know but yeah when i flashed it before it was screen recording perfectly but now it's not doing it so i don't know what's wrong with this it's kind of still unstable means it's still un unstable not the stable version but you know the lineage or roms get updates every week or regularly so no problem this will also get fixed and let's test the opening of apps yeah it's quite smooth and it's opening very nicely and there's no lag while opening the apps and here you can see the it's a selfie camera and yeah it's quite stable and so you can even make it in braille camera so wait a minute i'll show you so just see it turns to the rear camera and the camera doesn't have a lot of features but it does well and yeah it's a good camera it's really good and yeah it's quite working fine so it does take pictures and yeah it's here i just want to want to delete it so i'll just swipe up and it gets deleted and i'll undo it it just get back so i just really like this room so let me show you how it will open these files yeah a lot of apps got changed and it's a really good thing and yeah i'll show you the dark mode even which is separate so let's check out the dark theme we'll press on this and yeah it got changed to dark theme and now it's light so yeah it's quite good and let's get back to the home it's almost per working perfectly good so it might lag sometimes as it is an unstable build but overall the ROM is really very good and here you can see the screenshot option here for the recent you can take these screenshots and yeah 
it's quite smooth still opening the apps very perfectly and yeah i'll even show you the power menu so here you can see the power menu which is exact android 11 so yeah so even you can just play with these controls i don't know what is this but yeah it's a kind of good thing you can even play with these so yeah here you can see it's a type of control i don't know what's this but yeah it's a type of funny thing so all are working very good and yeah here's the wallpaper animation when we open the status bar the wallpaper gets back and when we close it it gets run yeah this is a cool animation and same for the menu bar uh, i mean app drawer too so it's really working fine and yeah it's not the actual review but i will review it soon uh, the whole thing i'll review of this room and yeah it's working perfectly fine till now but yeah if you face any bugs in this room just try reflashing the room and yeah you're done so it's working smoothly i can see so yeah it's really very good room it's still te in testing build and it's still under development but it really does a very good and you can rock it as your daily driver so yeah if you like this video please like the video then share this video to others so that others can know this know about this room and comment me down if you have any doubts and knock me out on telegram if you have any doubts and the room links and the bit gaps also i'll post it in description make sure you check out from there What is this love and what? You know that I love and got it fucking me wrong You know I ain't with it, never did it before He got me all in my feelings, now he got you all in yours Ooh, wow, ah, ah. it's like that He ain't never leaving, no, he got me right back I know that he ain't gonna shut you by back And you don't want nobody else hitting like that